Oh, it's cool, that, isn't it? Right. <laughs> uh, do something that looks brilliant when sped up or slowed down. You have one hour. Your time starts now. Near a golf course, could do a uh, drive. Looks quite good to slow down, doesn't it? Have a little think about it, I reckon. I've, yeah, I've got an idea, actually. Quite a good idea, I think. Who are you seeing first? We're going to start with Dave Gorman. Oh. Mm. Guinness advert. <laughs> it is available yeah, for Guinness if they are prepared to pay the price. Were those biscuit crumbs? That was glitter. Oh, sorry. I just think how much I like <laughs> <laughs> Well, so, pretty rock and roll video, really. Two famously rock and roll things there. Glitter and balloons. <laughs> Great, though. See some others. OK, the bar is set. Uh, we're going to see Sarah's slow-mo. Or fast-forward, we'll see. Okay. <laughs> Just ask me if there was someone in there. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if they did it like Wallace and Gromit. Yeah? Just moving a little bit at a time. It would have taken Sarah one month to make that. <laughs> <laughs> really, really impressive. Technology's always, in films, it's depicted as something destructive or frightening. Why not have a nice dancing robot? Yeah. Well, it was a story of loneliness and then companionship and then boogieing. <laughs> OK, it's time for Al Murray. I mean, <laughs> this is all the funny when you know that Al is the only person well I've ever met who knows someone who owns a gong shop. <laughs> this is the second time the gong has appeared in Dustmaster. <laughs> <laughs> She's gone mad. Yeah. She's gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I got it. <laughs> Did you like it? The I thought it was wonderful. <laughs> um, so presumably your facial expression was based on the wig coming off. Yes. All right. <laughs> what was the facial expression going to be before it turned into? <laughs> oh, something, you know, smouldering. <laughs> oh, don't. That's good. <laughs> Who's next? OK, how uh, about... Oh, Paul. Do you want to see Paul Chowdhury? Do I? <laughs> <laughs> Really clever. I'm the best at keeping up, isn't it? I can keep it up for a long time. <laughs> you did boast a lot about your football skills before. It was the ninth take, but it, you know. It... <laughs> the point is, you did a genuinely good film, and I honestly thought uh, it was going to be horseshit. So well done. <laughs> the only one we haven't seen here is Rob Beckett. Oh.
I am intrigued by the narrative of yours as to who the supervillain is that's coming after you because he is using three very distinct uh, weapons. Yes. <laughs> Peas, watermelon, flour. Mm. <laughs> it, yeah, the story of that was built some shit out some fruit and veg. Oh, <laughs> you didn't have in your mind that you're a character and there was an enemy approaching. Yeah, that as well. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm going to make some snap decisions on this. It's so tough. I thought they were all genuinely brilliant. It's harder when they do well, isn't it? OK. Oh, God. Last place? I'm, it's going to be Al. Do you know why? Because he's used his gong already and he didn't mean his wig to fall off. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm putting in joint next place, I'm putting Dave and Paul. And the joint winners for me, because I could imagine a narrative, are Sarah and Rob. Okay. Bam. I've done it. For more Taskmaster, subscribe now.